up out there in the field. Fine, fine, I'm just fine. I just need to bob all the pillars supporting that disco ball and I can get out of here. What's with taking out the disco ball? Its impact will shake the nightclub's front peacock side loose from its board. Look, I can't talk now. I've got to keep moving, keep safe. This is going to be sanity. So I played as Bentley, and I'm playing as Murray. Oh! <gasps> it's the gas. Sleeping gas. It's the tip time, and that's awesome. Even beat up a guard. No, I can't beat them up. I just did it. I took out the disco ball. Wow, we thought that all the way back here at the safe house. And you were right. The peacock sign had half of its bolts pop off on impact. Job completed. What am I gonna do? Get out of there? I can't even get over the gate. Oh my god, I punched a guard! Where's the safe house? I hope I'm going in the right direction. Maybe I can see it from a distance. Okay, I'm close to it. But I've gotta get to the house. They've got guards on me! I see the safe house, I can probably get in. I think I'm going in as Murray. Alright, let's go. But the thing is, I didn't even know that Bentley and, and or Murray could go on Vertigo. That's weird, guys. I thought it was only Sly, but turns out... Okay, I see where my location is, so shout out to all you guys who love pink. Be yourselves and be happy, because pink color is the representation of happiness. Okay, that guy spotted me. Okay, Murray. That alarm horn will tip off Dimitri during our heist. 
There are three of them out here, and I need you to take them out. Check. This is going to take some serious muscle, Murray. You're the only guy on the team who can pull this off. Mm -hmm. Stop to pick things up, then throw it at those alarm horns. Good luck, pal. This could get rough. Evil doers feel my wrath. Oh, that's funny. Guard. There's more of them. Oh, I threw it at him. Hey. There's another one. They have checkpoints. Okay. Oh, more guards. Oh. Okay. I see another one. You can't like get on rope. There's no way I can jump rope. Okay. Sorry guys. There's three of them. I gotta find the third one. The third one would have a pink checkpoint to it. Checkpoint! Oh no. This would become such a problem. Okay, fellas. The dominoes are all in place. Time to pull off the big heights. Okay. First, Murray will help me break into the old water tower. From there, I should be able to shut down the plaza fountain. Dimitri's sure to send someone out to get the repair truck. Slot, you'll pickpocket the truck keys off this guy once he shows up. Then hand them off to me and Murray in the plaza. We'll go steal the truck while you climb to the top of the nightclub's peacock side. When you're in position, Murray will fire the truck's winch line up to you and will use it to pull down the side. If my calculations are correct, the impact should create an entrance to the printing press room. Then, Sly, you jump in, grab the clockwork tail feathers, and we all get the heck out of here. This is going to be one hell of a heist. Okay. I'm going in as Sly. I mean, it doesn't really sound easy, but this is gonna take me in a bit. Why am I. You know what? I had to change this, Mary, because. It's a bit idea. Come on, chum. Let's get to that water tower. Come on, Murray! Danny, follow me. It's been... God! How did you know it was up there? 
Whoa! Jump into my arms. I'll toss you up there. Whoa! Do it. You're gonna have to blast your way in. All right. That was a little stupid. I need to focus. Which valves do I turn to divert water pressure from the plaza? To change the flow of water through a valve, I should press the circle button. Yeah, Murray. Follow the green patterns. sending out the repair guy to fix it up. Big block in the keys to his repair truck without being seen. Alright, it's go time to sly, so... checkpoint that's the safe house here it's all you let's head out for the repair truck I feel like I'm running as like an old grandma I don't know. Oh, this is gonna be long. This is gonna be such a long game, but they told me it's a nine minutes, fifteen seconds in about a couple of hours. Well, at least Nightfall knows that, you know, they, they take for a bit forever, but each game plays longer than the last. I'll take the wheel. I know how to drive a stick shift. I need to get in position on top of the nightclub's peacock sign for phase three. There's no way I have to get up to that cafe. Hopefully I don't get caught by these people with their fucking lights on. I'll wait for the guys. I'm in position. Great. We're just driving up right now. Get ready to grab the tow harpoon. Okay. Don't want to aim at it sly. Ooh. Wrong. Bad shot. Books on. Pull away. Sly, the guards are on to us. Protect the truck! Oh, great. A pig mouth. I don't really love her knowing it. How is this guy still alive? Oh, 
let thing down. Behold the majesty of gravity and inertia. That was real subtle, Billy. Okay, you jump in, grab the clockwork tail feathers, and we're out of here. <sighs> Shoot. Who knew what I was getting into? see the light of day. Just hand over the tail feathers and we can... What is this with clocks, bro? Have you no vision? Are you hearing what I mean to you? You think you have juice? Don't show me a little mind when talking about such big things. You think you can swing the bat? Show your bling and let me shine you. I have no idea what you're saying. And your suit sucks. No! Let's dance! <laughs> Okay. We gotta fight his ass. Woo! So much for that. I told you. <laughs> Where'd he go? I can see him. Nightfall, if you were here. Oh. You wanna play? Let's play. Shut up. Oh. He's low on health. I can get him, I think. There's no way I can get past Dimitri. Don't get in that liquid. Okay, I got him. It's a cutscene. Counterfeiting operation. It's past tense. I'm doing you a favor. What kind of thief prints money? There's no honor in that. You cracker box. Who oh, no. Triple job means the triple of the job completed. My gang and I have done it. The clockwork tail feathers were ours, and Dimitri's counterfeiting operation was ruined. Due to the untimely arrival of Carmelita, my escape got a little tricky. Angry at having just missed me, she took it out on Dimitri. Shutting down the nightclub and throwing the frustrated forger behind bars. 
gang and I headed out of town for a week in Monaco. I figured the team had earned themselves a well-deserved break. So much for the cops. Another clockwork part had surfaced in India, so the boys and I loaded up the van and zeroed in on our next target. A mysterious spice lord known as Rajan. A self-made man who grew up poor on the streets of Calcutta, he started his life a crime selling illegal spices in the black market, eventually growing his small outfit to a sizable operation and earning himself a seat in the prestigious claw game. <laughs> he since crowned himself Lord of the Hills, and while he goes to great lengths to convince others of his royalty, it's mostly to convince himself. True to form, he's holding a lavish ball in his newly purchased ancestral palace. The reason? To show off his latest acquisition, the clockwork wings. The symbol I have to of my wings. If you saw the wings silhouetted against the night sky, it was already too late for you. Especially if your name was Cooper. Rajan believes displaying the wings will bring in prestige, and maybe they will, but they're also bringing me. Mm. Oh, yep. <laughs> Not liking this. Who should I go as? Should I play a spy? Should I play as... Scope out the palace and then find a way to break into the ballroom. Let's find out who that does party. <gasps> With the drawbridge up, the only way across that river is on those conical rocks. Do you remember how to spy or jump? What? You think I'd forget one of the Cooper family's greatest thief moves? Whenever I'm near pointed objects, I just need to jump and hit the circle button to perform a ninja spire landing. That's correct. Now let's see it in action. Give me a little break. I figured out how to sneak in above the ballroom without being detected. The only problem is there's no way to climb up to that balcony door. Not a problem. There seem to be plenty of branches for me to walk on. I'll figure it out. Wings? Looks like the wings have been welded onto that statue. They look heavy. Getting the wings out of here will be a real challenge. An electronic witch. That could be useful. That's him. Rajat's really pulled out all the stops to impress people with this party. Maybe 
maybe you should get some shots of the guests. That's the Contessa, a high-ranking prison warden for Interpol. She must be working undercover to expose Rajan's spice ring. Carmelita is here too. She must be undercover with the Contessa to help bust Rajan. Another Claw Gang member. Our arpeggio specializes in exotic technology. Leila, another officer undercover. Watch yourself, Sly. This party is crawling with cops. Uh, Gene Bison. John B. Song, a member of the Claw Gang and Canadian shipping baron. He owns half the trains in Canada. That's all the photos I need. Bring them back to the safe house and we'll start building a game plan. <laughs> well done, me. Clockwork wings in the middle of a crowded ballroom is going to take some serious misdirection. And the squad of undercover cops only makes things more complicated. Although, we might be able to use them to our advantage. But no matter what we do in the ballroom, sooner or later we'll need to deal with Rajan's security chopper. Murray could take it out with some of the local armaments. But he won't be able to get inside the palace until Sly lowers the drawbridge for him. Fuck, dude. Alright, let's get going. all locked down. You know where I can find the keys? Key guards have recently taken up positions around the palace. Sneak in, pick all of their pockets, and bring the keys back to the lockdown witch. <sighs>
Well, I'm not getting that key. You can use noise to lure this guard from his post. Try ringing that dog and picking his pocket when he returns to his post. Those fucking monkeys are the ones from China. So what are they doing here? One more. Shit, what did I break? 